Hey, what's going on guys? In this tutorial series, I'll be teaching you how to use the Excel Writers uh, Python module to creating Excel files. The Excel Writers module is a Python module for creating uh, Excel SX files. And that means that this module will work with uh, Excel 2007 or later version. And unlike some other Python library and modules such as Excel Wings and the Wings32 count, this library will work with uh, just about any other uh, operation system like Linux uh, and the Mac OS. Some of the advantage of using Excel Writer package uh, is that uh, this module is very widely used by a lot of Python developer and users, especially uh, Mac and Linux users. And Excel Writer supports pretty much all the Excel features. This library is very well maintained and documented. So here I'm on the uh, documentation page. If you go to excelwriter.readthedocs.io, and this is the official documentation page. So if you just scroll down and you can see that, basically uh, they give you all the documentation for basically all the Excel method and features and properties that are available uh, within the Excel Writer package. And lastly, Excel Writer is great for people who do not know uh, anything about VBA since uh, everything they do uh, in this package to support Excel is very Pythonic and meaning that uh, everything they do uh, is mimicking all the uh, Python syntax. So one of the most important and probably the most critical disadvantage of using Excel Writer is that with this library, you can only create Excel file it cannot read or modify existing Excel files. If you're trying to modify an existing Excel file, then you want to use uh, other Python modules such as Excel Wings. And if you're using Windows, you can use uh, Wings32 count library. But those modules, I think they only support Windows uh, operation system. But that's the only disadvantage that I can think of. And I'll post the documentation link in the video description. So, um, so let's see, and now let's get started. And the first thing we need to do is we need to install the library uh, to our Python environment. So here, let me open my tutorial folder. And here, I'm actually going to create a virtual environment. So here, let me grab the uh, folder directory. Oops, let me copy paste the path again. And so here, let's uh, so I'm going to create a virtual environment. I'm going to name the environment XLSX Writer. And next, uh, let's launch our Python editor. And here, I'm using uh, Visual Studio Code. So actually, let me activate the environment first. And here I'm going to uh, activate the environment. Oh, so actually let's go back. And we need to install the library first. So here to install the library, you want to type pip install. And the package name is xlsx writer. And once that is done, so we need to launch our Python editor. And since I'm using Visual Studio Code, so I can just type uh, code and space and period. So that will launch my uh, VS Code editor. Now let me close the welcome page. And let's open a new uh, Python script. And for the first script, I'm going to just call this uh, demo.py. And since I'm using a virtual environment, so here let me uh, change the virtual environment uh, directory path real quick. So I'm going to copy my tutorial uh, for the directory path. And I'm going to just replace that with the current path. And close. Now I need to reload my window.
Okay, now if you look at the bottom uh, left corner, right now I'm connecting to my XL Rider virtual environment. So XL SX Rider, and this is my environment. And first, I'm going to import the module. So import SL X Rider. And to create a brand new workbook, so here I'm going to um, create a variable called workbook. And from actually here, I'm going to uh, give an alias. So I'm going to name the module as X, uh, XW. So XR Rider, so XW. And from the uh, XR Rider module, and we can use the workbook constructor and to create a brand new uh, Excel file. So here, let's call this uh, demo.py. Actually, no, not .py, .xlsx. And once you have the workbook uh, variable created, and we can uh, create uh, multiple worksheets. So taking the workbook uh, object variable, there's a method called add worksheets. And this method uh, lets you to create uh, worksheets within the workbook Excel file. So in this case, will be demo.xlsx uh, Excel file. And the name parameter is optional. So if you don't want to provide a name, and Excel is going to use the default name, like uh, she one, she two, she three. But if you want to rename the worksheet, so here we can uh, take the name parameter and we can name something like uh, hello. And to create another worksheet, so we'll take the workbook uh, object variable and we'll just type another uh, worksheet method. And this time we'll make that as default. And to write some data, so let's say I want to uh, type something to the hello worksheet. Uh, so here, let me should assign the output to a variable. So worksheet hello. And this one be uh, WS2, so stands for worksheet 2. And so here, I want to type something to the hello worksheet. And from the uh, worksheet object variable, there's a method called write. And in Excel Wing, they support the A1 uh, cell reference as well as the row and the column index uh, cell reference style. So here we can type something A1 by just giving the cell reference address and followed by the text that you want to type. So here I want to type hello world in cell A1. And in cell B2, and here in this time I'm going to use the, the, uh, the cell uh, style. So here, um, we can provide the, the row index first. And so it will be uh, the second row, so it will be one. And the first column will be zero. And followed by the text. So for this text, I'm going to say goodbye. And once you've done that, so here we can uh, close the, use the close method to uh, save the Excel file. Now if I press F5 to execute the, the program, and here I need to configure the Python debug configuration. So here let me do that real quick. Should be oh right here. And so let me add the configuration. And I'm going to just choose default and close. And let me close this again. So now if I run the program, and here let me open the, the folder real quick. Oh, that already created. So let me delete this file real quick. And now if I just run the, the demo.py. And uh, finish. So now if we go back to the uh, the folder. And here's the demo Excel file. Now if I open the Excel file. And here is our first text, hello world. And here's our second text, goodbye. And on the bottom, and here's the first worksheet, hello. And here's our second worksheet that we created while providing a name. So in Excel, they just named the worksheet as default uh, sheet 2. And this is everything I'm going to cover in the first video. For the next video, we'll learn how to create a simple Excel table using the Excel Writer uh, library.